I would like to thank Sister Tiffany Austin for sending me the donation for this video. Thank you, Sister Tiffany Austin, for sending me donation for this video. If any of you all have any special request videos that you want me to do, celebrities you want me to do a video on, YouTubers, a particular topic you want me to do a video on, there's a small donation of $5. The donation link is in the description box below. All right. Let me tell you something. I'm tired of black people. Black people talking about other people are culture vultures. Vlad is not a culture vulture. You know who are culture vultures? Black people. Black people are culture vultures. Why? Because we is going after and using and, and portraying ourselves, putting ourselves on other people's culture. Hip-hop is not our culture. Our culture is wearing fringes. Our culture is our women being modest. Our women being in the house. Our women being up under the man. That's our culture. Our culture is, you know what I'm saying, the Hebrew, you know what I'm saying, man, you know what I'm saying, raising and building his household with his family. That's our culture. Our culture is our people walking and talking according to the laws of Moses. That's our culture. Our culture is Hebrew. Being a Hebrew Israelite. That's our culture. Our culture is keeping the Sabbath days, not going out to the club, partying, and bullshitting. You see? Our culture is, you know what I'm saying, keeping the Passover, keeping the Day of Atonement, the Feast of Weeks, the Feast of Tabernacles. You know what I'm saying? Our culture is keeping the Holy Days. Our culture is being separated from hip-hop. Hip-hop is what the Romans, a.k.a. white man, then labeled us, you know, the same way we get mad when the white man calls a nigger. Well, we should get mad when the white man said hip-hop is ours. What the hell is hip-hop? Are, are you a bunny rabbit? Are you hip-hop, hip-hop, hip hop hip Hoppity hop. Are you are you a bunny rabbit hippity hopping hopping all around town? That's not ours. Hit that's not our culture. Our culture is not beatboxing. <coughs> Is that's all you worth? All you worth is a B box. All you worth is a you know what I'm saying? A uh, 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 um, uh, rapping, rapping. You know what I'm saying? Is that all you worth? All you worth is what is so called hip hop? Is that all you worth? No, that's not our culture. You know what I'm saying? We're in, we're in what the white man gave us. We're in that culture. Then we want to go into being African. You know what I'm saying? And you got Umar Johnson them. You know what I'm saying? Pushing that culture on us. And now we want to be that. That's a culture vulture because we want to be something that we're not. We want to be African. Then our women want to get Chinese writing on their body. They want to be Chinese. They want to be in the Chinese culture. You know what I'm saying? Every other nation got their own culture. You don't see no other nation claiming to be hip-hop. Because a culture comes with, you know what I'm saying, uh, um, uh, 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 a nation of people, you know what I'm saying, um, building unity you know what I'm saying unity and order you understand hip hop is not our culture you know what I'm saying look and see who patent hip hop it is the white man who patent hip hop they label you it and now we want to be it 
if all you're worth is a rap song, then you ain't worth shit. You understand? You know how they say, what is your worth? What is your worth? What is your worth? You black women, you are supposed to be the daughters of Zion. You are supposed to be the queens of the earth. So if you are the queens of the earth, why the hell are you calling yourself hip-hop? Queens do not call themselves hip-hop. Kings, which you black men are, kings don't call themselves hip-hop. Kings call themselves rulers. And the queens are rulers up under the king. So kings, where's your rulership at? Who are you ruling, kings? You can't be ruling your woman because it seems to me that your woman is ruling you. Every time I turn around, the women is ruling over the man. The women is telling the men what to do. The women is creating the fads and creating the trends, calling it hip-hop, and the Negroes is following suit up under the woman. What type of shit is that? You know what I'm saying? All I see, I see Vlad is seizing an opportunity on, you know what I'm saying, an opportunity to get some money. And he capitalized off of it. You see what I'm saying? That's all I see. It's the same way, you know what I'm saying? If if you if if everybody is playing a lottery because one per okay, I'll put like this. One person in your city won the lottery. Best believe and best believe once uh, everybody hear that that one person in your city won the lottery, you're going to have a lot of people going to that same store where that winning lottery ticket was to people coming in to play the lottery. Why? Because they want to seize on an opportunity. Are we calling that culture vulture? The lottery vulture? The lottery culture? The lottery culture. You know what I'm saying? These are different names that the white man made up and the Negroes pushed. The same way the white man made up Black Lives Matter. The Negroes pushed Black Lives Matter. But then who does Black Lives Matter belong to? The white man. Why? Because the white man is the one that made it up. Yeah, I know a lot of people say, well, that no black life matters for the gays. Yeah, but who controlled the gays? Again, the white man controlled the gays. Who put together the LGBT organization? Who allowed it to prosper? The white man, because who controls America? The white man, which are the Romans. See, while our mind is, 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 is stuck on little shit and we need to look at the bigger picture. You know what I'm saying? So let them have hip hop. You know what I'm saying? Let them have Babylon. Let them have America. You just claim to who you are as being a Hebrew Israelite from whatever tribe you from. You stick to that. You know what I'm saying? You black women stick to what you are supposed to do as a Hebrew woman. You black men stick to what you're supposed to do as a Hebrew man because that's your culture. But um, I want to thank your sister um, Tiffany Austin for sending me the donation for this video. If you're near, you all have, all have any special request videos that you want me to do. Celebrities you want me to do a video on, YouTubers you want me to do a video on, particular topics you want me to drop some understanding on. It's a small donation of $5. The donation link is in the description box below. Don't forget to hit that like button. If you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop this breaking news on you. And uh, don't forget if you want to um, tune into my nightly Bible study classes, you're welcome to do so. The Bible study classes... Just simply send me a friend request to my Facebook page, which is P.S.T. 
PSTR Michael Smith on Facebook. That's PSTR Michael Smith on Facebook. And I'll add you to the group. And you two can learn about who you are and your culture <laughs> as being a Hebrew. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.